What's going on, everybody? Yellow Mustang back once again. That is right. We are here, back in the lovely lands of Roblox. Uh, today, we are going to be fixing this mesh. I got a question on my Discord uh, regarding meshes and how you can correct the orientation of it in regards to the actual block faces. So if we look at this M4 here that I ripped out of free models, um, it's got this decent looking mesh here, but if we go down to the uh, surfaces and we select the uh, the front surface, you can see it's it's wrong. Obviously, this is not the front of the gun, and if you have this as the front of the gun, you're going to have to do some wonky stuff to get this to work properly. So ideally, you just want this front surface to be, you know, right right here with the barrel right so it, it's a fairly easy process so first off we're going to export this into blender so we're going to right click the handle here and click export selection and then we're going to export it as an obj uh, file or just name it m4 okay save all right so now we'll go ahead and load up blender here all righty everybody so welcome to blender uh we're going to go ahead and do a new file general uh delete the default cube by pressing delete and then we're going to do file, import, wavefront, obj. So that is the file type that we exported. So we're going to go ahead and open up that uh, mesh that we exported earlier. Uh, not this one. Uh, mesh fix, m4, obj. And then you would expect this to import to the middle, but it doesn't. Um, it is way out here. So what we need to do is click off of that, click onto it and just do uh, set origin geometry to origin and that will bring it to the middle for us so we can continue to work on this so if we press one on the numpad that brings us to um, the front view for the mesh so just press one that brings us there so we want to be looking down the uh, the barrel of the M4 in this view so we're gonna go ahead and just rotate it now which is fairly easy we can just use the transform settings over here and you can see um, on the on the z-axis is where we want to rotate it <clears throat> so if you rotate it just 90 degrees we can type in here 90 enter okay press 1 and then now you can see the M4 is now facing towards us perfectly so that's all good and dandy and now we can just go ahead and export this and uh, load it back into Roblox so we're gonna go ahead and go to uh, file into export and then just export it as a uh, wavefront obj and then let's see <clears throat> i will just go ahead and save it to the same spot just overwrite it uh, it's fine and then there we go so now we'll just go ahead and hop back into roblox here okay so we're back in roblox here let's go ahead and import the mesh now which is pretty easy so we'll just do Control i on the keyboard you can search the object just do a uh, mesh part and then over here um, on the right side here under properties mesh ID just hit the folder opening thing and then we're gonna go ahead and navigate back to our mesh fix folder and load up the M4 oh it's gonna tell you it has location data just say no and then there we go we got the uh, the M4 in the game here so let's look and see if this is correctly orientated and there you go so that's pretty easy so now if we compare it over to this one, you can see now the uh, front face is indeedly correct here. So now this should work uh, the way it was intended to. And that only took, you know, what, a few minutes. So uh, there you go. If you guys want to see more Blender content in the future, just let me know. It's, uh, I'm okay at Blender, so I can help you guys out. But uh, if you enjoyed the video, please like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time.